this new VW Touareg is slightly bigger than the previous model. This particular model we've got is the 3 litre V6 turbo diesel injection. And that retails at just over £38,000. This particular uh, example will cost £425 per year to tax. Volkswagen diesel technology is well proven. It won the Dakar Rally in 2009 and 2010 in a TDI Touareg. Compared to its predecessor, this VW Touareg is slightly bigger and has a longer wheelbase of about 4 centimetres. It's also, in my view, better proportioned, certainly from the front with a more distinctive grille and headlamp. Displaying a supposedly green credential here, although it does cost £425 in tax per year. Apparently VW say it will do 38 miles per gallon combined. There will also be a hybrid version of this car coming out quite shortly. That will cost a staggering £55,000 and the MPG will not be as good as this one. So work that one out, which one would you buy? That. This is a little bit cumbersome, it's not that light either. Right, so there's a flap at the side of the seat, so simply retract that and the seat back will go down and if you put pressure it will lock. Although not as flat as this area here, the same on this side. VW say that this will rev up to 100 miles per hour, 33% more efficient than the previous Touareg. And this is 8 speeds as opposed to the old 6 speed one as well. About 40 miles per hour and approximately 12.50 revs. Acceleration, pedal down. And what you notice when you do have to brake is the amount of weight behind you because you need to put a bit more pressure and really time it as well. As I'm going to do now, well before the actual roundabout. Officially I'm buzzing. So I'm driving a car that exudes quality and it feels as if it's been honed from a solid piece of titanium almost because it's so stiff. Feel so reassured. Well, I wish you could say that in the back. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's just a slidey seat. But for £38,000, I suppose you would expect that. That's true. But I can't understand why anyone would want to buy a hybrid that costs. You know, 17,000 pounds more than this, but yet this would be more fuel efficient. Although, of course, you'd be paying road tax on this and nothing on the, the hybrid. Now, VW have the build quality, but they've also got the image and the diesel engines to complement as well. 
You can't beat German build quality, even now.